like a fish, what? Oh. I just called the exterminator, Marge. I spotted a mouse in my home. Whoa. I want to put away all my valuables before the exterminator gets here. I left my bracelet right here on the table. Oh, my bracelet! It's gone! Oh, my priceless jewel bracelet! The one Grandma left me missing! No, it didn't fall off the table! There's nothing on the floor except... Marge, you won't believe this, but I think the thief who took my bracelet dropped his wallet! I'll be down in a second, Garfield. Let me just put my watch on and I'll come down and make you breakfast. It's about time I had breakfast. It's also about time I had some lines in this episode. <laughs> It's not about time for that. It's never time for that. I've been practicing. Let's see if I can get this into the next county. Now maybe I can enjoy my coffee in peace. Whoa! This isn't my coffee. My coffee doesn't quack. All right, who took my coffee? Something missing, Garf? Somebody took my coffee and left this in its place. Not again. Packy! Packy! My cousin Packy. He's visiting from the house he lives in down the street. He's a pack rat. Loves to trade stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Hey, hey, that's a great rubber ducky. You want to swap it for something? Oh. How about a yo-yo? Oh. How's about a genie with 14th century Ming vase? How about an autographed photo of Diddy food critic Eddie Gormand? How about my cup of coffee? Deal? I probably have time for a quick nap before John has my breakfast ready. Packy, will you knock off all this trading stuff? So, I'll just crawl up in my bed here and... <gasps> Packy! <laughs> I'm coming! Yes? John Arbuckle. We're detectives, Mr. Arbuckle. I'm Special Agent Frick, and this is Special Agent Frack. Huh? Oh. Mr. Arbuckle, you have your wallet. My wallet? Sure, it's right 
here? Did it look anything like this? Why, yes, that's my wallet. I wonder where I lost it. Maybe you lost it where you were stealing a bracelet. A bracelet belonging to Mrs. Ophelia Schmidlap, just down the block. S -s -s stealing a bracelet? <laughs> that's ridiculous. I don't have any bracelet. I don't know where there's any... 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 You better come with us, Mr. Arbuckle. Look at... No! Wait, no! There's been a mistake. I didn't steal this bracelet. Huh? This bracelet must have been on my dresser when I woke up. I put it on thinking it was my watch. Good story, Arbuckle. But you'll have to do a lot better than that. Oh. Huh? It's the truth! Somebody help me! <laughs> oh. Okay, okay. There's your bed back. Are you sure you don't want this pump? I'm master? not trading it. Just let me sleep. <laughs> Leave me alone. Whatever it is, I'm not interested. This bracelet must have been on my dresser when I woke up. you guys. I never went near this Mrs. Schmidlap's house. So how'd her bracelet get in your house? On your wrist. Oh, for the millionth time, I don't know. Lock him up! Well, what are you waiting for? Lock him up! That man stole my bracelet. But I didn't. Won't anybody help me? Oh, yeah, yeah. So it's a simple deal. You give me the peanut, I give you this electric razor. No? Okay, I'll throw in a set of snow tires. Ooh, my final offer! The razor, the tires, and ten free dance lessons! I wonder where John is. More importantly, I wonder where my breakfast is. Breaking news to report. Police are holding a local cartoonist on suspicion of stealing a bracelet this morning. Authorities theorized that John Arbuckle needed money. An investigation determined that he spends an awful lot each week feeding his cat. I'm... I'm a motive. John wouldn't steal some old bracelet. <laughs> of course not. I wonder who done it. <laughs> He done it. Yeah. You, I didn't take Mrs. Schmidlap's bracelet. Then how did you wind up with it? I'm staying here until he confesses. Talk, Arbuckle. What did you really need the money for? Mm. I can't believe anyone could spend this much each week to feed a cat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I believe you. Garfield, get me a lawyer. I've got someone better than a lawyer. That's not a mouse, ma'am. That's a rat. A pack rat. A pack rat! The kind of animal that takes objects from one place and switches them with other objects. Hmm. <laughs> oh. 
Hey, Garfield, you got something you want to swap for a stapler? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll get him the stuff. Hey, hey, how about this detective's briefcase? I'll take that. <laughs> Looks like that explains how your wallet wound up in Mrs. Schmidlap's house, Harbuckle. And how her bracelet got to yours. Well, I can see I'm not going to get satisfaction here. So I'll just get my hat and go. You're free to go, Arbuckle. Just stay out of trouble. That's trouble. Come on, guys. Let's get out of here. Now remember, no more trades or swaps or taking stuff. Promise? I promise. Okay. I'll see you back at home. Hey, hey, you out there watching this? You want to trade that remote control next to yours? How about that bowl of cereal? Don't we buy it for the price? Hey, I got some nice police station furniture here.